And for you guys, I made the screen a little smaller. Normally, I do the full if I go over here and do this. Normally, I will do that, but for face cam, it was going to be too small. So, Gutsman is who you're supposed to start off with, so let's go with Gutsman. But, something came up. I, ha I went into town, um, so. Went out of town, I should say, so. I couldn't. I was I was I was too busy that day. I was getting ready and I just was like, eh. I played a few games after. Goodness gracious, I wanna stream if it if possible, if I beat all of these, I do want to be able to stream all of them. You're annoying. Why can't I hit you? I feel like my timing's off. I've done better playing with myself on the rides. I've been playing a lot of Mega Man games. Actually, uh beat Mega Man 2 for the first time finally. Of course with rewind and stuff like that. And checkpoint save, but. Once it gets close to me, I'm saving. Because I've seen this before and I know it's difficult. Where's the buster? We're gonna try to play 1 through 11. I have both collections on my Switch. We're playing on my Switch right now. I probably should put that in the description or something. Um, but right here, we have to be really, really careful. Uh, maker. Okay, we finally made that. I'm gonna edit that out for you guys. I, that's why I kind of want to stream this on Twitch because having the stream and the edited video on YouTube seems a little strange to me. But you know, it is what it is. This game's not easy. So, of course it's not. It's Mega Man 1. But we do have other things to at our disposal. Like this. Yes, I'm going to be using these a lot. If I was better at the game, I probably wouldn't use those. Um, I could challenge myself on not using them, but nah, it, for, for... That's something I would do on my own time. Because doing that on a stream would be... Yeah, I think it would just be a little... Just adding extra time to the stream and it would be a little cumbersome, so... No, I was... There's similar enemies like this on Mega Man 11, and I wonder if they might be the same enemies, actually. I always say, oh, these are from Mega Man 11, you know, but they are. They might be slightly different, but there are, uh, those things are in Mega Man um, 11. There's, uh, what's his name? The guy from Mega Man 11 that has the, it's like a concrete man of that game. I forget his name, but I think I have the boss order memorized for that game. So that'll be nice, because that means I'll have to write it down. But I have beaten that one a few times. That one has a lot of difficulty settings, so that made it easier. I've never played it on really hard difficulty. I've wanted to try it, but I know I'm not good enough. I want to make it as hard as these original games. Well, I've never done that, and I probably should do it. I'm not going to do it on a stream, though. I could do a video where I try that. We're going to go... I would. I might do Mega Man... Try a little bit of Mega Man and Bass. I know it's really, really hard. But I don't have, I would have to ROM it, and I'm playing these officially since I have the collection. Can we back up real quick? I hate to do this, but there is an extra life right there. Um. Supporting this. I might try to stream some of this on Twitch because, okay, I'm struggling to get that. Honestly, I don't know how I would get that, so we're just going to move on from it, and we're going to do a quick save real quick. It's nice how quickly you can save. I've got both collections, and I'll show you guys. I've got both of them. I also got all the X collections. I don't have the Battle Network collection yet. But I, I might, I'm thinking about, once I get through uh, Mega Man 1 through 11, starting the X series, because I've never beaten all the X games, X7 is going to suck, but it's part of the series, so. And then the Zero series, I want to do Battle Network, but that's going to have to wait. Since there's a way to own it officially, um, I want to do that. I'm saving money right now. So right now, I don't have a job. My dad actually pays me for um, doing some work around the house, so an allowance, so not a bunch. Like right now, I have like what fifty-four dollars or something. I want to buy the the Battle Network collection, but I'm gonna need to. It's sixty bucks for the whole thing. But the thing is, if you buy them separately, it's forty bucks each. So I'd be spending more buying them separately, and I want all the games. So another twenty dollars added if I do that, because I can afford to buy one of them. But I would probably buy, if I were to do that, which I'm not going to, if I were to do that, um, we, we don't have enough health here. Okay, I'm just going to take a hit there. It's going to take me a minute to beat him. Is he, I don't remember if he's in, I don't think he's in, I think this is a boss. This is one of the most memorable blob bosses in the entire Mega Man. One of the most iconic bosses in the Mega Man series. So I feel like they should put him in Mega Man, um... Maker, because I don't think he's in there. So 
started season two of Mega Man Maker. Really happy about that. It takes time. I wanted to do it. One, uh, Jethawk suggested I should wait until the update came out. Because there's a 1.8.4 update coming soon for Mega Man Maker. But I was just like, eh, I'm, I've been waiting on this and I've been wanting to do it for a while. So. Few weeks because I got all like, my wisdom teeth pulled and then I had some and I had like uh, food poisoning so that was fun. Alrighty, there we go. So the level's over. Goodness gracious, yeah, there's gonna be a lot of editing here because I'm recording the whole thing. I had to record, do this on Twitch, and then for you guys, oh, it'll be like a video. I kind of want to, I like my com little community, small, com very small community with like three or four people on, on here. Um, but like you guys, I really appreciate that. But wait, what's going on now? This is comment stage, isn't it? I'm actually not sure. I didn't click on anything. What happened? Um, we're gonna have to go back and watch that. It was weird. If this is the right stage, that's fine. If not, that's gonna suck, because it means we're gonna have to go back. One thing I've been trying to figure out is how you set passwords, because I wanted to mess with some passwords. I got stuck in Mega Man 2 um, at the final boss, and I was like, oh no, I'm gonna have to redo all this. But I, I had to start restart the entirely Wily stage over, because I used up all my energy tanks before um, fighting Wily. <laughs> And so I couldn't beat him. It was like, oh crap, I have to restart this whole thing. And I was like, I want to type in a password so I can just get right back to the boss. But I couldn't figure out how, I looked at the passwords, but I couldn't figure out how you type them in. So. I will only use passwords like in circumstances like that. Um, otherwise I won't. So I want to play through the whole thing. I don't want to skip anything. Okay. Careful. I feel like because of the layouts on these games and the background and everything, like we're gonna have to in each game we're gonna have to um, have the face cam in different places. <laughs> Seems quite funny. It's gonna be a little weird, but I don't want it covering up all the, the characters. Uh, the Mega Man um, Laser Collection Two has weird different backgrounds, so that one. Um, we're gonna have to do something else. So I want to see if this enemy drops any health because we're just about to die. So wait for it to go to the other side and shoot it. It did. We're lucky. Barely any though. Barely. Which is really unfortunate, but it is what it is. I thought about buying this collection on PC once, but now I'm, for right now I'm not gonna do that. I could do that, but I already have this collection in two places. I have it on my 3DS, but I bought it on here because I. One of the reasons is because I can't stream it on my 3DS since I don't have any equipment for that. I don't have anything that can record that. And also, I kind of moved on from my 3DS and I, since I got my Switch like in 2019, I rarely play it. The only game I play on there really is uh, Samus Returns every uh, so often because I love Metroid. I do have Mega Man 7. I do actually have the collection. I also uh, bought Mega Man 7 separately since you can. For some reason, Mega Man 8 was not put on the 3DS, but it just wasn't. But I did buy Mega Man 7 separately on there. But now that I have Legacy Collection 2 on here, there's no point. I had Legacy Collection 2 on my Xbox once. It was because I had Game Pass and it was on Game Pass. But then I then I couldn't get have Game Pass anymore to do some complications because my brother had it and I don't have a job so I can't really pay for that. Even with my allowance, it's just not enough because you have to pay like 20 bucks a month. Okay. And I want to be able to save for other things as well. So, and then they also took um, Legacy Collection 2 and I think the first one off Xbox Game Pass. That's the thing about Game Pass is that Game Pass is really nice to have, but when they take games off there, and especially if you want to play them and they take them off, it can be really frustrating. Um, that's like the thing with streaming services too for like movies and things and series. Like, they take them off and then. You, you have to either rent them or find them another way, maybe find a DVD. It's like a pain, I hate that. I do have more health now, so I can survive a, maybe a couple hits. 
I don't know if that's hurting him. I don't think it is. What are those blocks that are in? Go this way. Get out of here. <laughs> Where are the boss now? Um, or close. He's right over here, I remember. Um, but we do have one life. So I'm going to do a save real quick. I'm actually... Um, should I let one of these enemies heal me? Heal me before I get to the boss? Let's do that. So I think I should I should um, go back right here, right? So we only got two of those. I always like to do it as soon as our health goes up because that means we don't have to wait for that every time if we die. Oh, we missed. <laughs> Goodbye. So we'll go ahead and do this. I don't know what the purpose of getting those clear points is. The later game, even I think Mega Man 2 doesn't have those. I think this is the only one. Ah. Oh. Okay, I've had enough. Ah! Goodness gracious! Can we try and get that help? Oh! This game's hard! Of course it is, it's Mega Man, but like... What? Uh, oh! How would you get that? Okay, you now we're back up here again. I want to know if that could grab it. I don't know how you get it otherwise. We don't have rush coil. Or do we? No, we don't. Hey, welcome to the stream. So I'm enjoying me dying a lot because I suck. But. I'm playing through Mega Man 1. Whoa there. My dad actually had Mega Man 3, which is funny. But I became a Mega Man fan. Um. Because as a kid, um, I had Mega Man Zero Four. I got Mega Man Zero Four for my Game Boy Advance, and so that's what started it all. I was like, "Oh, I'm into Mega Man now." Mega Man Two is really hard too, but I feel like Mega Man Three is easier than both of them. Both, both of the first two. That's just me though. Gosh, dang it! I'm gonna get up here. The only really hard thing about my, yeah, that's, I'm actually at that part, because I've been playing it on my own time a bit. It's really, really frustrating. Okay. Alright, so here we are. Go up here. Okay, I'm gonna... So I'm gonna go ahead and... Do that. Whoops. Um, I don't know if there's... I'm going to save here. There's a kid... I'm not, there could be an energy tank or something. This game even have energy tanks? I know this is the original. It has to, right? If it doesn't, then that would suck really, really bad. I hate those enemies. I hate those things. They're so annoying. I want to go that way, because that way looks a little suspicious. Like there could be something there. Stop that! Go! Ow! We've got Gutsman's power-up, so we could actually... Try it anyway. <clears throat> nope, that didn't work. I can't get past this stupid spot. Super annoying. We're finally up here. I, 
I'm gonna try to get this. I don't know if he's even have any purpose in this game. Because you can't buy stuff. I think the first time you can actually buy stuff was in Mega Man 9, right? Or was it 8? I don't remember if it was 8 or 9. Because I know in 9 you can, but I'm not sure if you can buy things in 8. Uh... You know you can't 1 through 7, of course, because that was not really a thing that games would do. That's a fairly modern thing. I know this is supposed to be hard, but like... Imagine, I just can't imagine how you would beat this back in the old days, like back in the 90s. Because you didn't have a rewind, you didn't have saves. If you died, you had to restart the whole whole freaking stage. Yeah, you know insane that would be? Well, you have lives, but if you lost all your lives, you have to restart the entire stage. I wonder, can I? Cause I just want to get up here. What? I thought I had time. This one you have to be really fast because you also have to jump up here. <laughs> okay. Um, we're going to do the save. I wonder if this game doesn't have energy tanks. Let's support, look this up. Okay, so it doesn't start until 2, so this game does not have energy tanks. Oh! That post said only Mega Man 2 through 6 have energy tanks. That must be really old. Mega Man 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11 also have them. So. All of the Mega Man games, even the X, all of the X series, they all have them. These have got to be the absolute most annoying enemies. Get out of here! Go away! How long have I been streaming for? My task bar is in the way for the next boss. I had, to, I had to know that. I don't know I've been playing in the old days. You have to figure out. They had this. My dad told me about this magazine called Nintendo Power, and you could find like passwords and stuff. I know for these old games. My dad had Mega Man 3, but his cousin, um, or not his cousin, his actually, his, uh, nephew had Mega Man 4. Funny enough, his nephew, because of the spacing where my parents and every, my, um, uncles and aunts were spaced how far, because my, one of my aunts is, um, my, obviously my dad's sister, but she's 20 years older than him, so, yeah. Uh, she had a son at the same time that my grandma had a son. So, well, a couple years apart, my, my dad's nephew is only like one or two years younger than him. And he had like, I think he had Mega Man 4, that's my point I'm getting into. He had, okay, so we're just gonna let him kill me. Um, because I, yeah, hopefully I have. No! Oh, crap. Um, that sucks. So, the only way I'd be able to kill him right now uh, I don't have any extra lives. So, let's see. His weakness is this. But, we're gonna probably have to restart the whole stage. Yeah, we're gonna have to restart the whole stage. That sucks, but we don't have any extra lives. Oh, no. Uh, let's see. Uh, so it was Cutman. Not that weapon. It was Cutman's weapon. Well, that's one way to kill him. 